In this video, I will give some tips to help you identify a knowledge gap or an unexplored area on which you can base your research. I'm going to tell you how to do identify gap in the literature. As a lot of students who are new to research face difficulty in identifying gaps from research papers. So I will tell you simple steps that will help you to identify a gap. Research gap is a research topic which has not been addressed. It provides you the reason for conducting your research. They drive you to think about your research questions. Research gap equals the deficiency in literature. How to identify a gap? By reading multiple paper on same topic. By reading future directions and limitation in the article. So let's get started. Before you starting to identify gaps in the literature, you need to figure out what your area of interest is and then focus and narrow that research area. In order to find articles that are specific to your research area, go to Google Scholar from your browser. Then after that, you need to type here the topic on which you are conducting your research. Like my research area is cyberbullying, so I will type it here. Press enter. As you can see, there are a list of articles that are showing up all related to cyberbullying. The years in which they were published are mentioned. All these research articles are old like articles that were published in 2010, 2008, 2012. Note that in order to find gaps on your research topic you must consider research articles that are published in recent years. In order to do that, you need to click on custom range. You have to look for paper from recent years. Like I'm searching for article from 2017 to 2020. Click on search. Now, all these articles are of recent years in which you can find what is unexplored area that researchers have pointed recently on cyberbullying. For example, I have selected this article. Now in order to read this article we need to download it. To do that open the article. Copy link address. Go to Sci-Hub website to download the article. Link is in the description box below. Paste the link address. Click on Open. Download the paper. The paper has been downloaded. Open the paper. As you begin to gather gaps, critically read for what has and has not been learned from the research. Use the discussion and future research sections of the articles to understand what the researchers have found and where they point out future or additional research areas. Now, I am going to highlight the gap. You can also search for future by pressing Ctrl plus F button. Use tools such as MS Word to map out the research you find from scholarly articles. These methods would be helpful to organize what information you have found and what is shared among the literature, as well as to identify what areas may be missing in the research. The gap which I have identified I will paste them in Word document. Also remember to write the name of author with the gap and also mention the year. This would help when you will write your research literature and to build the model.
download multiple articles on a specific topic. Like you can see I have downloaded a number of papers on cyberbullying. You need to find multiple gaps on the same research topic as one gap is not enough to build a model or to conduct a research. Find gap from each paper and paste them in Word document. You must have a gap for your independent variable, dependent variable, moderator, and mediator. Hope you have understood the process of identifying gaps in the research papers. If you want more videos comment in the comment section so that next video